Welcome to Today I Work On and welcome to the Sprint the Van episode where I'm going to calculate how many miles per gallon my 3500 Sprinter four-cylinder diesel actually gets with a full load. Van is stuffed with all my tools and a bunch of parts that are heavy for my track car. And then we have right here, we're at the limit of the standard Sprinter van, which is 5,000 pounds with my Track S2000, with the Grom, with the tire rack. So this is gonna be a really good video. And then we're gonna compare it to the video that I did just recently on the mile per gallon trip that I did the Philly and back. This is about a, probably an hour longer of a trip, different terrain, but I'm gonna do it coming and going. But I figured since I just did the mile per gallon video and I have all that data, it'll be good to compare it to how this big monster trailers. I mean, look at this rig. This is huge. So I, I just wanted to give you scope. Uh, so let me stop talking and let's uh, get the VIR. drivers in TT5 but anyway back to the miles per gallon I had to reset everything because we used the van to heat the van and the miles per gallon went down from 13.7 to 13.2 so I didn't think it was fair to keep that data so I just reset everything so now we're gonna head home and then we'll uh, recap and see what the miles per gallon is com compared to regular driving with a full load I have a full load in here to trailering. So you have a really good picture now on what this uh, four cylinder diesel does. So let's go.
the data that I accumulated on this trip and regen is a killer. So both on the trailering side and on the mixed use side, I lost one mile to the gallon coming and going. So when we were going to Philly in the mixed use, about 15 minutes after we started driving, we went into regen. Going down the VIR, we were about three quarters of the way into the trip and we'd regen it. And I mentioned it, gas mileage dropped like a rock, like a literal rock for those 15, 20 minutes that the van was in regen. Trailering, we're getting around 13.7 to 14.7 miles to the gallon. Mixed use, we're getting 21.6 to 22.6 miles to the gallon. And that fluctuated between 13 and 14.7 was actually the highest MPG I got. So trailering wise, we're getting between 13 and almost 15 miles to the gallon. Mixed use again, we're going to get between 20 and 23 miles to the gallon. And regen completely kills gas mileage. All the other data is the same. Uh, on the trailering side, we did 229 miles at 52 MPH average. Coming home, we did 252 miles at 52 MPH average. Same average, but a little bit more driving, but almost a gallon MPG less. Pretty impressive. So I also had someone that commented on the Sprinter Van Facebook forum. They're like, you can explain this in one or two sentences. And honestly, you can't because there's a lot more dynamics going on. I idled the van for like an hour, an hour and a half, I think when we were sleeping in the van because it was super cold. And before we went to sleep, I turned on the heat. So that killed gas mileage. I lost almost one MPG just by idling. That's not really a fair comparison on what your actual miles per gallon is. That's this video on the miles per gallon on trailering. And then I was able to bring in the other data on the mixed driving part of the Sprinter van. So I'm not sure what else I could do on miles per gallon. That's done. So that's something that's taken care of. And if you like this video, please like it. I have other Sprinter Van videos. This following video is my fourth trip to the dealer and that was some heck of an experience. It wasn't a big issue, but it was another issue from when I purchased the van new at the factory. So if you want to see that, please subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time.